Hello, and today we will have the third and final review of an ornament for a while. This is the Snow Miser ornament, which is a good ornament, and it will I recommend it for your tree. I'm just going to say that right off the bat. This one is going to be one of the rare ones, okay? And I know my channel is in good quality. It's not horrible quality. It's not bad. It's okay. But if you want to get a good channel eventually, then you're going to have to wait a little while. You're going to have to wait a little while. But you get to buy Harmark and Keepsake, which is basically the same thing. It's from the year without a Santa Claus, which is, the movie is right over. Um, the movie is right over there. Can't even see it in the picture, though. Alright, so, sorry about that. Okay, let's look at the box. You have the Snow Miser prototype, then you have the year without a Santa Claus logo. Snow Miser, so on, Christmas tree ornament, ornament, pour. Ornament for, for Labre de Noel, which is, basically, which is, I think, Spanish. Yeah, it's probably Spanish. No. No, it can't be Spanish. You have the Christmas trees, then you have the basic summary of the year without Santa Claus. You have the designer, and so on. Artist crafted. Time to celebrate. And then you have the top of the box, which is a 2014 logo. Show what year this ornament is from. Now let's look at the actual ornament. It's a very, 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 very shiny ornament, but this is like the other two. Or I could just um, show you it. I have to kind of hold it. Mr. Snow Miser. This is my favorite of the two Miser brothers. brothers. And here he is. So, he's not magic like the other two, or should I just say battery operated. But he's still a nice addition to your tree. He has a, let's go down. So, the hat has detail. It's basically just snowflakes and a hat made out of straw. He's holding it with his right hand. Can't really tell. My my right. And he's white. S snow white. He has a um he's very snowy, sparkly j sweatshirt. I shouldn't he has very white and sparkly clothes with some it represents small snow on top of the blue sweater and his scarf, which is basically just a blue and light blue. You have a clear little piece of plastic, which represents his cane. The top of it is just a snowflake. Which is just a snowflake. And you go down, and he has these little, like, elf-like shoes. His feet are just really, really skinny. So his legs are really skinny. The scarf goes down about two, um... The scarf is pretty long. And you have the snow, you have the logo. They're basically the advertising. You have a somewhat clear head. His detail is pretty nice. He's pretty reminiscent of the Clave Nation figure. So I would recommend getting this figure. But it's going to be one of the rare ones. It's $14.95. But get it quickly because it's going to sell out too quick. You know, I I, I the, this was getting so, this one was getting so sold out, I have to buy, I had to buy this online. And I would definitely recommend getting it, it's a very nice figure, and if you really like Snow Miser or any of the Miser Brothers, I would recommend getting this one. And eventually you'll be able to complete the pair once Heat Miser gets released, if you were, if you were unfortunate to miss the, two, uh, the 2012 release of the two. Now, nice edition, get it, Christmas is coming. November 4th, get it, that's all you have to do. So, Snow Miser, great figure. There he is. Bye.